What is up, my YouTube family? We're back again with another one. It is Johnny Gobble himself. Tickle fight the mayor. And his wife is in on this one as well. What a conspiracy. Anyways, guys, I don't know why I talked so like that at the beginning. It made me feel like a kind of a detective, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, guys, without further ado, guys, love yourself, like yourself, be nothing but yourself. Like, subscribe to the channel. It's highly appreciated. Look, this gobble stuff has gone way too far. It's time for an Inspector Gadget to come into play, and I'm here today. Your boy Deuce is here. Thank you, guys. Without further ado, this clip is actually of, or this video is actually of Johnny Gobble and his wife. His wife puts her two cents in, which that's his prerogative, I guess. I don't even know how to spell that, but I said it. Anyways, without further ado, guys, let's get to the video. Enough joking around, I guess. Let's, let's continue. Brought me, me and my daughter into it, dumbass. Oh, are you live? Yeah. So, I guess she was practicing for her debut i guess that's what you can call it anyways this whole problem has started whenever gobble started drawing uh, pictures of upchurch and uh he wanted upchurch to have the picture um he said that upchurch wouldn't have to sign it you can check out the videos on his on his channel anyways it started way before that even i came to find out it started whenever I do believe he was making a video and it all just backfired. Um, he was supposed to, he wanted to work at uh, Ghost Ranch. Johnny Gobble did. Um, I guess he's been an Upchurch fan before this. Um, now, I know a lot of people are going to be in the comments and be like, well, you don't know what's going on, so why are you speaking on it? I just said it. I just said it. Without further ado, guys, let's continue. <coughs> no, I'll let people get in here. Tell me when they're in there. I will. It's going to be posted anyway. Gobble, you post everything you do. Which, you post your daily life. But your daily life has literally been nothing but pressing charges on people or, or drama. Your subscribers come from Upchurch making songs about you. If it wasn't for that, you wouldn't be in the position that you are as far as subscribers. And congratulations on that. But it's true. That's the truth. But you won't just be quiet about it and move on with yourself because you know that's where your subscribers are coming from. Let's continue. We're going to uh, expose this um, Cami right now, right here. Exactly. Right now. Guys, we're going to expose Tammy right here, right now. Who really cares? It's become a competition. Repetition. Let's continue. Listen here, peeps. I don't get abused. I like peeps. The peeps that you get in Easter, at Easter, peeps. I like them. Let's continue. I say what goes on in my own house. She handles the money. I handle the money. I pay the bills. Of course you do because you're he doesn't work. So of course you're gonna pay the bills. Of course you're that made I guarantee if that was me what? I would have done tucked my head and walked out of the frame. I pay the bills, I handle the money. Is the road switched? I'm confused. Let's continue. My kid hasn't been touched. CPS has been here twice because some idiot say that my child is being touched inappropriately. Not happened. I'd kill somebody. I'd kill somebody. This man has raised her since she was two years old. She calls him dad. It takes a real man to step up and take care, and, of, a kid, and take care of a kid that isn't even his and to love a child the way that he loves her look whenever you have a kid that isn't yours 
and you try to take care of it, it's hard. Plain and simple. Because you know that kid's not yours. So the bond of having your own child, your own blood, isn't there. But if you don't have a job, do you? Is it really taking care of that kid? It's really not, in my opinion. He's there for her. Congratulations. Really. But do you see where I'm getting at? If you have a job and you financially take care of that kid, then you're taking care of your family. Let's continue. Yeah, they've been here. They have been here. Yeah, they've been here a few times. And they've times. laughed about the accusations. Well, the first accusation was that she was being touched inappropriately and that on a live stream, Johnny hit her in the back of, a head, back of the head really abusive. Never happened. They didn't know my kid's name. Um, they didn't know the time frame of the video so the CPS worker could go and check it out. Um, so she said that she couldn't. Well, all videos is posted on YouTube or TikTok or whatever else platform you're on at that matter. So if they wanted to, they probably could have checked. Am I not right? Let's continue. Do nothing with it. So then that was on a Friday. A Monday rolls around. She shows up at my house. Says that we out of school. Said that weed was being smoked with around my kid. Don't happen. Don't happen at all. I don't care if no. Gobble made a video of himself daydreaming about Upchurch. Driving his truck to the school. And he even said he's there to pick up his daughter. Which is responsible. Which is great. Okay? But he was high. And he even admitted to being high. He smoked a joint before with Upchurch, so he says, quote, unquote, in this video. And he smoked more than what he should have, he said. Now, does that make sense? Because an understanding must be a misunderstanding to understand someone's ability of well, speech. You see what I'm saying? If that makes sense, I guess. But anyways, he was there picking up his daughter. Right? Hi. And he even admitted to it. Even the teacher said something in this video about your eyes looking awful bad. So that's what she's referring to now. It's on video. He did it. Let's continue. Nobody cares or not. Uh, this is um, aimed towards Cami Victoria, since she wants to say that she will help me get out. Get out of what? There's nothing to get out of. Thanks, Tyler. I mean, to be honest about it, this woman looks happy. I'm not going to lie about that. She has no bruises on her face. She looks like she's well rested. I mean, she looks like she's in Wells Arms. To me, anyway. So, let's continue. I'm glad you finally got on there because these motherfuckers are fucking stupid. They're like saying I'm controlling everything you do and, and I'm abusing you. Dalen Horn is weird, dog. <laughs> okay. So? Everybody's weird. <laughs> I'm not answering no negative comments about yeah. church. I, I, I don't get into that. I have nothing to do with that. Look, that right there should tell you every, everything. She literally just said she's not getting into upchurch beefs with her husband standing next to her. That's how it should be. Now, it must suck for her to live in a household that, well, her husband is beefing with somebody that, well, is much more of a stature than him. He's gained his YouTube channel from all the drama with Upchurch, the songs Upchurch wrote and about, written about him, and everything else. But now you have Dad Byrne speaking in the background. Well, she just let it know, look, 
I have no beef with church. Let's continue. That's between him. He's a grown ass man. What he does while I'm at work is none. I don't give a shit. I'm just defending myself. Damn! She just said she didn't give a shit. Gobble? What you doing when she's gone to work? W O R K? J O B? She's. J-O-B gone to work. She doesn't care. She wants no beef. She made it known. You're a grown man. Let's continue. And no, he does not make me get on here and say what I'm saying. I am my own person. I speak for myself. And no. He doesn't make me get on here and speak for myself. I'm my own person. No. Around the world. I get better frames on my camera or something. It was blurry. Anyways, guys, let's continue. Yeah, some of the stuff I don't agree with. I've spoke my piece to him about it. That's that. No, he hasn't been trying to text no 13-year-old kid. Never yes, have I. Yes, he said he was going to text up Church's sister, but no, he never once texted her. Did he know she was 13? No. But the, the thing is that the text never got sent. But, but, what? You're his wife. You know he was going to text, text somebody's sister that he's been infatuated with because Ryan up Church is it star okay he's a fan of Ryan Upchurch is what I'm trying to say now let me ask you a question let me put a scenario out there what if he would have text Ryan Upchurch's sister being a fan he's just trying to get closer to Upchurch at that point that's what he's doing them two's the only ones that knows really what it was about and his wife literally just said that she didn't care. What? Let's continue now. Let me let this know. Texting a 13-year-old girl is terms for missing in action, I guess. That's for anybody. But now, I am not saying to go after this guy johnny gobble don't go after this guy don't go put turkeys in his yard no matter whatever he's literally eating his own words at this point let's continue that's the point oh i know she stays up all night trashing us i don't care obviously she doesn't have a life either who doesn't have a life let's go back Let's continue. That's the point. Oh, I know she stays up all night trashing us. I don't care. Obviously, she doesn't have a life either. And no, I, you probably won't get me back on here no more because I'm not all about the social media bullshit, but I... Now, who stays... It's a girl now? Stays up all night trashing you guys? Is that what you guys do is stay up all night watching people's lives and recording people's comments, recording people's phone calls, recording, and I know this is an older video, but this showed what she's about. She doesn't want beef with Upchurch. She doesn't. She said her husband's a grown man. She's just letting it out right here. But the best is yet to come. Let's continue. I was clearing the air on some shit here. And for the Genesis Boyer, that that girl don't know what she's talking about either. I don't know her. She says that she knows me, that, she, that we grew up together. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. I don't know her from Adam. So, I... And, no, I'm not on drugs no more. I've been clean for four years. 
I don't. I don't do nothing. Yes, I go to a suboxone clinic. You can call that dope, drugs, whatever. I don't care. Well, let me tell you something. Suboxone is a drug. So, therefore, it means that you was on opiates at one time, I'm guessing. Um, so, you was addicted to opiates. So what? Doesn't make you any less of a person. At least you went and got help with it. And you're taking a drug for a drug. So, basically, I do believe Suboxone is, you know, has a little bit of something in it that you was used to at that point. I think that's what Suboxone is, which is good. It's better than you going out here and eating candy, I guess. But you see what I'm getting at? Suboxone is still a drug, but you're clean. Congratulations. Let's continue. That's what has saved my life. Um, yes, at one point in time, I was on methamphetamine, heroin, coke. Um, I was probably on it, but everybody has a past. And that's where it needs to be left at, is in the past. People get mad because people straighten up and change their lives. Um, they get jealous because one's doing better than them. Um, so, I mean, that's all I've got to say. I'm going to give it back to Johnny. What's up, everybody? I said congrats on the four years. Thank you, Mitch. She's, I'm, I'm proud of her. She's come a long way. Next, I'm going to do my phlebotomy classes to take blood. We are all sinners. And That's obvious. right. It's actually, we all judgmental. We all are. We all sin. Every we all sin, people. We all sin. I was going to turn into like Wolverine or something. I don't know. But anyways, he's literally got the phone back now. Now watch how this whole conversation goes sideways from here. Listen to what his wife says. Let's continue. We're seeing uh, every day, every Look, day. I don't want you paying no attention to no What's negativity. What's up, Rachel? I ain't never paying don't no more attention. No, more no negativity I'm not. not paying attention. Now, mind you, this video I think was six weeks ago, something like that. So, no more negativity, correct? Well, if we watch the video that I posted on my channel about him sitting outside waiting for people to come into his yard and destroy his yard or leave him some more turkeys, decoys, decoy turkeys, which they did as well. My, it's actually on my channel as well. Check it out. But he has cameras in his windows now, which is congratulations. Go watch that video because he's trying to, you know, s protect his family, but he's outside with the cameras facing him. Anyways, let's continue. Inside my house, you hear me? What's up? I got 181 people in here. Are Damn. you hearing me? I'm yeah, talking I'm hearing, to you. I'm hearing and I'm you, talking babe. to everybody on there. Yes. I... Your boss has spoken. Talk to her. She pays the bills in that house. She holds the money in that house. Pay attention. Let's continue. I'm hearing you. Don't yes, bring no more negativity into yes, my home. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Now, you could tell by his demeanor that this guy got pissed. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. What? Just don't say nothing. Just shake your head or something. I don't know. I don't get talked to like that. So I don't know what that's like. But I can tell you what I would do. I would finish my video, nod my head, and finish it up and get off here because... Basically, that voice is telling you to get off. Let's continue. I love you. Thank yes, ma'am. I'm not ma'am. I'm your babe. Stop. I know you're my babe. I'm just saying yes, ma'am. Well, I'm just okay. fucking with you. You well, know that. I don't like that. <laughs> you know that. I don't like that. So. We just wanted to clear the air. We just want, we just wanted to clear the air because this, this bitch is stupid. She needs to find some She really needs to find somebody help. else that really needs help and if, go, go if get them help. that's what she's doing. If that's what she's really trying to do. So, but it sounds like to me she's candy. on there wanting to bash people yeah. and bring people Obviously. down and tear people down. Obviously. And that's not really helping nobody. So really, what the frick is she doing? Look at this guy's demeanor towards his wife now. He's pissed because, well, the boss has spoken, guys. Plain and simple. We know who wears the pants in this relationship. Let's continue. Let's finish this video.
That's all I need to prove. Let's continue. What's going on there? Um, a hypocrite, maybe? Yep. That's what it looks like to me. What it is. See you all. See Have a blessed day. Anyways, guys, that is my reaction to Johnny Gobble. Look, we know who wears the pants in this family. He needs to just take off his belt. Something. But now he dresses in Chicago Bulls outfits, Nike outfits. He must have got enough hand-me-downs, I guess. Hand-me-down. Hand-me-down. Wipe me down. You know, he must have got enough of that stuff. But in other words, this guy is... I don't, I don't even know anymore. I'm out. YouTube fam, your boy Deuces is out. Thank you guys. See ya.